This doesn't fit like it used to. For a kid who has been dead for 3,000 years, we know a lot about King Tut. We know he was roughly 5'6", he had scoliosis, probably walked with a cane thanks to his club foot, he even had malaria in his system. All that info from a shriveled corpse, and that's forensics for you, something from nothing. The forensic angle dominates at a temporary new exhibit at the ROM covering mummies. There are six human remains on display in their wrappings. With the help of modern scanning technology, the experts are able to learn how they lived and perhaps how they died. The miracle here is CT, computed tomography. It's a way of stitching x-rays together to get a 3D scan of these people's bodies while, get this, keeping them in their original packaging. It's unraveling the past without unraveling the mummies themselves. Which is kind of nice, because a lot of these people believed they needed to be intact in order to have an afterlife. Like, how pissed would you be if you got dragged out of heaven because some rich Victorian wanted to eat you as a natural medicine? So there's a solemnity to the exhibit that they put front and center. You know, these were people. One of them was a child. And as much as I enjoy a Boris Karloff kind of thing, it's definitely kept on the down low, and I can't argue against it. Of course, there's a bit of theatricality. You know, the whole thing feels like entering a lost tomb, but the rest of the time is like being in your very own Discovery Channel documentary. It's all science. You know, you look at the wear and tear on the pelvis, and you can tell how old, roughly, the person was when they died. You can also see what artifacts they carried with them into the afterlife. One of the mummies has amulets wrapped in with her, and they've been able to scan them and punch them into a 3D printer, so you can have a rough idea of what they look like, even though they're still buried under layers of cloth. There's some freaking cool science going into this, and it's only going to get better over time.